Welcome back to Fox 4 News at 5. They've become the pride of sports fans in Kansas City. The Royals hoping to clinch their first divisional championship in 30 years tonight right here at home. Fingers crossed and there's a special honor awaiting one fan favorite. Fox 4's Sean McDowell is working for you live at Kauffman Stadium with more on all of that. Sean. Susan, John, a huge night for the Royals. Of course, they meet Seattle again tonight, and Alex Gordon is awaiting a pretty special reward for some civic activity he's been involved in. He is the ball club's nominee. Every club gets one nominee, but he's the Royals' nominee for the annual Roberto Clemente Award, which goes to baseball's most civically-minded and community-active players. One family from Overland Park says Gordon's time made a difference in their son's life, even though the two of them never actually met face-to-face. Hold on, I gotta get back to Gordon. Gordon right, there. right there. A phone filled with photographs is a reminder of a year long struggle. Can I get your homework done? Oh, yeah. Playing baseball was 12 year old Jacob Sprinkle's top concern until he was diagnosed with a form of non Hodgkin's lymphoma in August of last year. He needed nine months of intensive treatment, and his family feared the worst. When your child looks you in the eye and says, Mom, if I go to heaven, can you come see me? That is a tough day. I was scared because I was of the needle I was seeing, and I don't like them poking me with the needle a lot. Jacob was too sick from treatment to play ball with his teammates from Olathe, but they didn't forget about their own number four, who wears the same number as his baseball idol. Slicing and. Royals left fielder Alex Gordon was invited to one of their games as the team collected money for Alex's Lemonade Stand, a national pediatric cancer charity for which the Royals helped raise money. And he couldn't come, but he uh, got to FaceTime him. Gordon, along with retired Royals outfielder Les Norman, chatted with Jacob on the phone while the 12 year old was bedfast and sick and Gordon still had to play his own game that evening. He was all smiles. It was just a very happy moment. And I think he even asked Alex to hit a home run that night for him. He is researching about cancer and helps people. He helped you, didn't he? Yes, a lot. Now, one baseball tournament this past summer, Gordon helped raise over $34,000 for the Lemonade Stand Fund. All of that goes to help kids who have cancer and are in need of medical treatment. Gordon will officially be recognized as the ball club's nominee for the Clemente Award coming up a little later this evening, just before they take on Seattle. Sean McDowell, Fox 4 News, working for you live at Kauffman Stadium.